the, the only re problem we have is that we have a law school that has a smaller capacity. Are, you, are we suggesting that we know, the, the, the reason is not that uh, people don't get in at all. I mean, it's, uh, it's not that people really cannot, um, you know, cannot pass the exams. I mean, they, they, there's been all these mass failures, but we've also shown that as soon as they do these research, they, 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 they pass. But if they pass, they can't they can get in because there's a certain number that's taken at a time. So you already put a cap on the number you are taking. You are not saying like any other profession. When doctors go and go and write exams or nurses go and write exams, they don't say we are only taking 100 doctors. So if a 1,000 doctors go to take an exams and only 100 places we have, the rest have failed. I don't think that's the logic. Everybody who wants to be a doctor can go and go through the process, the regrow process of becoming a doctor. There are people who are doctors who are sitting at home. It doesn't mean that they are not, they shouldn't be qualified as doctors. So I, I think there's, the, the logic for me is not, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't fit. Let us go through the regime, whatever regime that you have to, but putting a cap is not the, 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 the way to assess quality. So the, the way to assess quality is to put in the, the bar exams or whichever mechanism you want to put in place to weed out people who are not qualified.